Welcome back. We have a great presentation here, one of our favorite segments here, the uh, Weber Chevrolet KPLR 11 Tools for Teachers. If you've seen us do this before, we typically have the person who nominates our winning teacher here. Well, this is our winning teacher, but the nominator unfortunately is sick with the flu. So I am here to present $500 to Lauren Widmer. Congratulations to you. Thank you so much. And so the person that nominated you, Cassandra Akers, was one of your students, and she experienced some bullying in the classroom. And you teach in the Melville District in an alternative school. Is that right? Mm -hmm. It's an alternative program in the Witzel Building. Um, and actually, when we had Cassie as a student, I was a first-year teacher, and it was our first year as a program. So she was really one of the first students that we had, and um, we really got a feel for how to individualize our program and really reach out to students when we had her. Well, and we, we have obviously done so many stories about bullying. It is one of the issues that we talk about um, so much. What was she experiencing, and kind of how did you maybe guide her in a different way? Um, you know, traditional high school drama is something that a lot of students experience and when you have a really um, safe and supportive home situation it's easy to get to that because you have those supports at home but um, most of the students that we have come from a situation where they maybe don't have that support or they don't have it full time um, and in Cassie's situation it was just much more difficult for her to deal with and you know, she just needed to be in a location where she could be around other students who are experiencing the same thing and just get a little bit more support from her teachers. And I know she wants to be a nurse. Is that right? She, she does. Um, when we had her, she was participating in the half-day tech program at the Tech South High School. So when she came to us, it was really all about helping her see the connection between our class content and her future right. as a nurse. To so, get out there and do something. Right. The she classroom. already had that motivating factor, so it was easier to help her get towards that finish line of graduation. Now you said you were a first year student. This has to be a, uh, under the best of circumstances, it is a challenging job. Uh, what what did you sort of bring to the table to kind of work with these kids and, and because you were so new, right? I mean, you didn't really have that wealth of knowledge and experience to draw on. Well, as a first year teacher in any setting, um, you're still kind of figuring out what's gonna work and what's Absolutely. not. And this was a brand new program and these were students where the tried and true methods just didn't work. So I don't think it made that big of a difference not having that experience. Mm -hmm. And as an extremely young first year teacher, I just was honest with the students and said, I'm not that much older than you. <laughs> I was here five yep. years ago. I'm here to help you get through it. And it was more about making a connection with her personally. And that was, you know, the biggest thing that I can do. That matters a lot. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Good. Well, congratulations. Hold up your check. Be proud. Lauren Widmer, Melville School District, $500 from our friends at Weber Chevrolet, our tools for teachers. And we certainly hope that Cassandra's feeling better. Yes. Uh, the flu much. is never fun. I think summertime flu and illness is even worse. So I'm sorry yeah, about that. Up inside. Yeah, exactly. Stay inside, get better, and then get back outside and enjoy the rest of the summer. Again, congratulations to you. We thank you guys it. so much. And thank you, Cassie. Absolutely. If you'd like to nominate someone, we have all of the information online at kplr11.com.